Hello dear friends, this is Hello Hollywood. That means you're in for some exciting news. Let's get started. The wedding of Diana Spencer and King Charles was one of the most eagerly awaited events of the 1980s, and wedding photos of the couple continue to circulate to this day, as Diana looks completely in love with her man. The wedding at St. Paul's Cathedral in London was attended by 3,500 guests and was watched by 750 million people from 74 countries in 1981, earning it the affectionate title, Wedding of the Century. I remember being so in love with my husband that I couldn't take my eyes off him, said Diana. I just thought I was the luckiest girl in the world. He was going to take care of me. The photo captures the moment the couple walk out of the cathedral together with Charles 31, dapper in his military uniform and Diana looking on with a personal smile in her pure white dress carrying a bouquet of white flowers. But few could have predicted how sour the relationship would turn out to be between the royal couple, who gave birth to Prince William in 1982 and Prince Harry in 1985, as their union ended in a bitter divorce that divides fans to this day. Diana tragically died in 1996 in France and Prince Charles, now the king, married Camilla Parker Bowles in 2005 and she now holds the position of queen consort that many believe belonged to his first wife. Camilla seems to have always been the king's true love, but many would say that doesn't excuse his behavior towards Diana, which included a heartbreaking outburst on the eve of their wedding. One of the most shocking things Diana told me, Penny Thornton, a friend of Diana's, stated, The night before the wedding, Charles told her he didn't love her. I think Charles didn't want to go into the wedding with false intentions, he wanted everything to be by the book and that was devastating to Diana. So there you go dear friends, share this video and leave your comments, bye.